Hey everyone, it's Alex from Red Time, and we're here today, we're actually in my man cave, and what we're doing is we're going to do a quick unboxing of the Semix Wolverine. So this is a European exclusive, a friend of mine wanted to get hold of it, but he's over in Australia, so I managed to place the order for him, um, getting it in, and just going to go over it, open it up, make sure it's all safe for him, so that when I can send it off to him and, uh, you know, check everything's fine. So keep watching guys, let's see what you're doing. As I was saying, so this is the Semix Wolverine. Uh, I've opened this up, two birds, one stone, really. So I ordered this for a friend who's over in Australia because this is a European exclusive. So I placed the order for him and it's just turned up. So I'm going to make sure that this is safe, uh, all in one piece, and then I'm going to ship it across to him. And uh, the other side of it is uh, Geo and I have just got new cameras, uh, camera phones. So um, I'm playing around with the settings just to make sure that we can film in certain lights in certain rooms in the house. Um, we did a few days of filming with it and uh, I'm not totally happy with the way it's come out so I'm clever on the scent so it's kind of two birds one stone. Um, I don't know when I'm seeing Geo next I think it's like a week or two weeks so I don't know if I'll still have this piece in hand I'm hoping if I do uh, Geo and I can do an actual full review of it uh, rather than just the unboxing so um, let's go on with this so this came from uh, from Sex. so being in UK this was pretty good because there was no uh, tax on this so we used to high shipping high tax being in the UK and it's quite refreshing to actually have you know neither of those so um, I think shipping was something like 30 euros which is about 25 pounds and then no tax which really really helps uh, especially with the way prices are going up okay so let's uh, get him out Right, so you've got the art box here. Um, sort of yellow art box. Print's not that clear, but it's okay. Also, this bit with the Wolverine there. Uh, Wolverine 16 there, Semix on the bottom. Uh, sculpted by Eric Sosa. And uh, Wolverine there. The piece here actually looks upside down because you kind of want to do that to open it. So that does look upside down, but never mind. Maxim style solid box with the uh, straps. So one lay and uh, one, two. I don't know if you can see that, but there's the box there. <coughs> Straight on the base. Got my lazy Susan ready. So, set my head, and uh, you've got these kind of like breed bar bits coming out, which are a bit precarious, really. I mean, I don't see that being the best way of doing it, but, but none of them seem to be damaged at the moment. Um, put this straight onto uh, the Lazy Susan, so it's 39 of 900. Uh, no exclusive. I think there was like a metal plate, but this one doesn't seem to have it with it. Uh, body. So here's the body here. All great sort of texturing on the legs and on the abdomen. And then the uh, kind of hair on the arms is, yeah, it's done quite well, I guess. Like I said, looks a bit weird, but I'll save that for another day. <laughs> uh, this goes straight into the base. So, so I can go down there. Oh, it's not in there very well. I have to have a little play around with that. It doesn't seem to be sitting in there very, very well at all. And then you've got the, uh, the arms. Some real metal claws. Some high chrome. Uh, very nice, so that is 
that head. Um, we've got three heads as well, so this has kind of mouth closed head, which is kind of like a Judge Dredd kind of look to it. And you've got the uh, kind of teeth kind of look there, which doesn't look too bad. And then you've got the, um, the old mast head. Down there. I'll do some close ups in a second. So, yeah, this one unfortunately didn't have the metal plate, which is the exclusive. So, yeah, we didn't get that one in there. So, what I'll do is again, this isn't a review, it's just to make sure the piece is okay. I'll do the review when I, when I see Geo next. Um, yeah. <laughs> Let me get this off of here. Okay, so we just start down low, doing up and down. Give a little spin of the base. Not that impressed with the paint of the uh, Sentinel. And I'm not impressed with this going in here, but this might just be me being a bit special, so I'm gonna to have to give that another go. Um, I think there could be a little bit more texture going on. Face is not that bad, you know. And then you got so so there's this head, and you have then the head with his teeth snarling. Doesn't look good on there actually. Head looks too small for the neck. Struggling to focus. And then, uh, actually, it's probably best to do it like that. Quite like the unmasked one actually. I'll just see if it fits properly. I don't know, it looks a bit off for that neck. Yeah, there's a big gap there. Hmm, okay, well, anyway, just sort of showing these off, um, showing that it's all one piece, and uh, yeah, what we do then is um, I'll wait for Geo to come over, and um, yeah, we'll do the review. So, thanks for watching, guys. Um, yeah, thanks for the patience there. Cheers. Bye bye.